Yeah. Well, items but. you can crit really easily, but he's really mobile. So if you get him caught out, that's it. But let's see how this game is going to about because we are into our potentially last game of the day. BTR, what game up against success is what's going to happen. It's great to actually see Bane being uh, revived into the metas here, but Arab, oh my, that definitely packs a punch coming from Jason Cole. Good and amount of damage. AX, uh, he's just uh, driving past and just going to tax the wave. Uh, meanwhile, Jason Cole uh, does about the same thing, uh, yeah. soaking a little oh, bit more wow. damage, but here comes BTR. Aggressive play from BTR, but smart move from Assassin's understanding to trade instead of fight because of the Grok is way too hard. Whoa, wait a second, look at Harley and Smooth, Cuckoo. Um, uh, 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 that's gonna be a truck okay. coming in. Uh, uh, they have to are you still going for it? Adidas coming true. Not sure who got the buff, but that doesn't really matter because Harley is in the thick of things. They are gonna trade onto Harley Smooth in a bit of a pickle. He doesn't have Where it. Is he going? No knock up, yes. but that's the crack. Claw Cat picking up the first kill. Ah, uh, that wasn't worth it at all. Uh, I don't know, it's questionable play. To be honest, it's doing pretty well because they have the gold lead. <laughs> um, you can say so, but like, uh, not and worth dropping some EXP for the Harley. It's, it's really crucial that he stays alive. Yeah, yeah, but you know, a two buff start, stealing both buffs from enemy and now gonna pick up their own one. Unless Sing has something to say about it. He's trying hmm. to linger around. Harley is tanking it up. Yep, gonna give it up. So Exas is actually... Gonna pick up an early lead for themselves. Pretty good. Yeah, it's not too bad, I would say, after uh, considering all of that. Uh, mm. you're, you're right. Uh, good point, good point. Oh. And now, of course, the boot being bought there by LY4. He can sustain for longer in the lane. Can just slowly try to chunk out Tamas from afar. Now, I, I would say that uh, this is gonna be an attack. Oh, revealing uh, themselves already. Yeah, they know. They know that two members are there. At least they didn't see the Akai just yet. But Mr. V does have the rapid boost. They might want to look for a play in that bottom side. Jason Cole trying to cut the wave. But is this a little bit too greedy here, Contra? Uh, I would say it's definitely greedy. But he's trying to run for his life. Midnight Fury. Yeah. That's an easy pick bottom up lane. there. Bottom lane is dead as well. But because of the deadly cash, he is going to get so much more sync. Even tank it up for the minions. But I think Cuckoo cleared up all the minions. So they couldn't push here. So good shot from Exasis, actually. Yeah. Uh, I gotta say, uh, I'm still really impressed but like that trade over on the top wasn't really necessary um it was too greedy, still... too greedy from yeah this. well here comes kcp just creating a little bit of pressure as they try to fight for this first turtle of the game mr v joins the fray and of uh, course kanita will secure that with the rapture version oh, oh the pick off from the end zone into the kill oh breath of the ocean gonna clear our tower away from the hurricane that's well force the flicker out of the burn from the emblem not enough, but that's a message sent to XS in here. BTR is not about to give them an easy game. Yeah, and uh, I gotta say that uh, he just flickered in time, but uh, look at how things are going so far. Bigatron with really, really decisive shot calling yeah. coming in. And especially Jason Cole's way of the dragon right there. Beautiful, beautiful stuff. He yeah. left the top lane just to make sure that they could execute all these plans without even having to worry at all. Now, that's why we see the strength of Bane straight away. Deadly Catch is going to clear up that turret. And that's the first turret of the game going over to the Singapore squad. Can pick this up. Oh my god, LY4 is just happy days. Everything <laughs> into his back pocket. Yeah, just sipping a little bit of rum there. And here comes Arab here just to contest a little bit too late. As LY4 gets himself even more gold. Thank you very much. Meanwhile, oh Easy my. Clear, right? The minion wave just goes down so quickly. Things going to get up his blade of despair in a little bit of a time. This allows BTR to just slowly push out all the other ways. Here comes here, Arta. Here comes Arta with the blender. Does tag onto Sing. But with the waveform, gonna get that extra distance away. Now, here comes Arab once again. Arta just trying to <laughs> create a little pressure on. Oh my! Oh, of nature, but here comes a two man knockup onto the ball of tags. Will the dragon kick back Arta? Gonna get that kill as easy as that. And now, Bigatron in full sprite. Of yeah, sprite. they're going full swing onto the bottom side as well. Look at the damage being done there. Oh man, Cuckoo could not even hold his own even as a Tamas. Yeah, I mean, let's look at the items really, really quickly. Blade of Despair, almost done. Oh no, he's not going for that, that build actually. He's gonna go for the Blade of the Hepta Seas build. Interesting there. And yep, completed straight away. But now, Sing. Sing is there. Let's go. Thank you so much, Observer. We're gonna change it into the team fight instead. KCP coming through, just oh. gonna cut the waves. 
think is there or oh, Arab? Goodbye. <laughs> this is the way out of that one. And of course, uh, Grokko's already put up a really, really sick wall just to make sure that they could nullify any sort of movement. But here comes Jessica. Needs to be careful. That's at the shroom pole, the flicker. Just to get an extra distance move. Did pop the daily magic onto oh. maximum charge. Did get tagged as well. But Jason Cole just a little bit too healthy for him to go down. The rest of BTR now on the top side. They might fancy a fight. Mr. V leading the charge. Not finding anyone. And looking into the side of the turtle uh, is already getting the health chunk down there by Mr. V, KZB as well as Sink. But every one of the assassin is ready for a flank and they're going in right now. Oh, Arab does have the minion free, but the breath of the ocean is there. He just cancels it out. He didn't even get to use the output sink. Clutch prediction. Wow. Got the turtle. Got the knockoff. That was just sync! So in sync! <laughs> yeah, I, I knew you would. That was a preview. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, you saw it coming. Yeah. But, uh, I mean, now, he, this is Bigatron in cruise control. LY4 farming non-stop already. 3 0 and 0 highest net worth in his team and going to have the blade of despair in a little bit more but he's just going from lane to lane farming from up and down yeah and you can see that he is one of the richest members around uh look into how things are going so far for the assassins however oh mr v does get tagged your oh, wow charge is there where's the daily catch the hell parts there are no assistant oh mr v does have the flicker pain four from ax will finish that off so far one for zero exchange as LY4 couldn't kill off Arthur or Smooth, but they do have priority on this top side, and I think that tower should be going down soon. Yeah, definitely will go down. They cannot contest this further. Meanwhile, Cho keeping that Tamas occupied here, and uh, he could even like uh, go in for a 1v1 if he actually dares to, but still, Cuckoo has still got the ult. It's a little bit risky, but here comes KZP facing off against Arab, Arab there. Minion Fury into the flicker. They do get all three members. Where are the follow ups? No one existent. The one that went down is actually Jason Call off the mini map. Not really sure where it was, but I mean that's the that's the goal that you want, right? That's the trigger. When the Mia Fury comes out, you want to go for this big team fight, but no follow-ups. Oh yeah, so, and the match up fine. Jason Cole, who's just rotating across. But uh, looking into how things are going so far, I think Exhaustion's hoping to play until the late game, but even so, can Smooth burst people off by that? Uh, uh, at least he has some items. Yeah, at least. Uh, not too bad. Not too shabby. But I tell you, when LY4 picks up the play of the spare, he's going to hit like a truck. Yeah, he's going to cry out loud here, but... Uh, speaking of that, AX got himself the blade of despair. Uh, but it's so late, it's really 8 minutes of the game. Yeah, you can say so, but uh, look at BTR once again. They're just going to snowball from this point onwards. Judging from the goal, already more than 3,000 up ahead. And BTR found Arab rotating inside This is the a jungle. good play from Exasis, actually. Very decisive. Understood that they were not in, you know, in the position to go for turtle they did push out oh, a lot in the top side but in the top side oh meanwhile Arta does get focused out rum onto this archive Arta needs to be careful they're back in the back off for now they're gonna clear up the waves they're looking for a team fight here BDR BTR just respecting all these uh, movements is knowing that the rest of assassins have already backed away from the top side they went in for a reset but here comes KZP oh Breath of the Ocean gonna knock up Cuckoo Tamo's first catch within a fight Mr. V in the thick of things here comes the book and here comes the minion free does come to all five members by KZP with the nation's shield just reducing so much damage that Mr. V wild charge that is on the three members and now they can chase Sing is feeling confident Breath of the Ocean wait for I'm gonna take that out why not take a mania why not take a bow oh Sing just took it out. They're gonna take the game at this point. Our sink just playing out of his mind. He got a maniac out of that and wiping every one of these excesses clean. And this will be a replay in tribute of sink. Now let's see this team fight. It, it looked good. Are up five members on that minion three, but just nowhere to be seen. Look. They were not in sync at all, and KZP Nature's shield was active, so reduced a lot of those damage, and Mr. V, bam, three members, knocked up, and Sing just chased for days. But the wild charge combo, along with Katita right there, was just phenomenally 
well done. They timed it perfectly. Oh. The damage output was enough. And uh, oh my, <laughs> what do we have here? Oh, so almost a good guy to spare from Mr. V. And this way, you can't really give Grok away, right? The early game pressure is too much. The stats is so high. You need to make sure that you have a strong early game to counter it out. Assassins, they did okay in the first few minutes, but it was the first team fight. They just lost out everything. Yeah, they totally lost out way too much. And now, this huge deficit that they're facing here, the only way out is to steal this Lord. And uh, looking at that, Grok has already begun uh, tickling uh, the feet of Lord. Uh, hopefully, don't have do the something fastest lord uh killing composition but now yep they're just fading it out they do find arta that's the tank though from the ocean on the lord lord gonna chunk down those health bars you can see off camera yep jason call playing the distraction game they are slowly burning down lord oh my god Jason Cole oh, has so no. much damage. Ara is in, in the front of it. Minion Fury kicks away the Minotaur. Wait a second. Here comes the Universe Sync. He's going to go down before he can do anything. This could be the turnaround that they're looking for. They need to catch up to it. Oh, going to go down it. over to Assassin. This could be the turnaround they're looking for. But LY4 right, will back out. One for exchange so far. KZP looking for it. But they're looking at the team fight. Jason Cole in full stride. Going to use the Jig Kundo. In the Oh, the turnaround. Going to get that kill off. Mr. V going to chase it out. Where's the Wild Charge? The Banner's Bear. Going to block off AX. The power. Of nature into the slap and to the clap. Oh, that was such a clutch, but it's not over yet. Cuckoo comes in. Daily Magic is active. Axis is fighting back for KCP. This is one tough tree. And finally, Deforestation fights back. The power of nature just showing you how much of a chaos they can bring. But that team fight itself, Assassin's dominated and has the Lord in hand. Now they can actually make a little bit of a comeback. Mistake, mistake there from Sing unfortunately. He was the one with the retribution. He took way too much damage. And he didn't even pop his ultimate. So unfortunately he just went down. But it's not at the end of the world. Still yeah. 7,000 goal lead for Bigatron. But at least Assassin's still looking a little bit better. And KZP just tilling over onto Arsenal right now. No damage whatsoever, but here comes Jason Cole getting zoned away. Meanwhile, Grok has been sent to deal with the top lane board right there. Not gonna result into much, but at least it buys him enough time to actually try to oh. do something over the bot side. KZP, in the face of three members of Assassins, they just clear out the Lord there. They lost, I think, one turret. It's not the end of the world, it's fine. But PTR by Assassins, they need to take this aggression and to go with it. Try to find some momentum blender, not gonna attack onto anyone. Looks like Ara tried to go for the steal, couldn't find anything. Ara still playing with fire here. Uh, he just sees KZP and he thinks like, hey, Valerie's not gonna do anything to me. So he's still fine for now, but he needs to find a way to pick uh, people up, but he could not deal with Cho as well, so it's quite tricky from the side of Assassin's that they go on a chase right now. Yes, the tricky is to work while charge onto Arab. He doesn't have the Minion Fury Flicker. active. Flicker is forced. Now, that's a big cooldown. Looks like Bigatron, they have set their sights onto this bottom lane. They do have a Siege Minion in the hands of their teammate. Daily catches their arrow. Does have the range from Guardian's Barrier. Does block them off. But look at, look at mid and top. It's all Assassin's. Yeah. Uh, this was the plan all along. Buy time and give room for Tamas to actually secure the tower. And now Bigatron forced to fall back uh, for the first time ever. X Pax Assassins, although having that deficit, they are forcing Bigatron to play defensively. Wait a second. Is this the sparks of the comeback? Yeah. Assassins looking strong, but Ira perfect. looking a little bit out of control. Oh, AX does get caught out. Does have the chemical caution to just get over the wall. Slides away. Ira will need to back out. Courage Bolt popped another one. So both Courage Bolt has been popped from Assassin's side. BTR could look for a go. Jason Cole. Jason Cole. <laughs> uh -huh. Dancing with fire there. Faring death right in the face and saying no. They got concentrated energy in the hands of Sync right now. So, uh, coast is clear right now. Seems like Cuckoo still stalking over all these BTR members as he looks for a back lane flank. Let's figure that. Jason Coe spots him out. We'll force him away. 
Back into his target range yep. he goes. They need to control all three lanes. LY4 is doing exactly that. They cannot let this bottom lane push because the next fight should be at this Lord. They want to pressure it out. LY4 going to make sure that the lane doesn't push against them. They were going to take this crap for good measure. Get some extra gold into the back pocket. Yeah, and uh, he secured most of the goals right now. And the uh, first one to hit level 15 as well. Look into Jason Cole. Splitting over Lord all these lanes. And yeah, you heard the call. Lord's coming out. That is the goal that they want to go for. But remember, they do not have the fastest Lord killing composition. No marksman means no damage. And that's going to be an issue here. So yeah. Does go and clear out the minions. They do have the deadly catch once to clear out the inhibitor. Do they get it? No, they do clear out the minions in time. So the defense is here. Arta actually going really, really deep. Oh, no, up. that it's was bad. Be thing by Hurricane Dust comes in. They try to kick them away. Ara, Minion Fury, but they have seen no one to follow up. They need to back up. This is a very, very messy team fight. Mr. V in the thick of things. Got his barrier just block off everything. Mr. V with the flicker. The next wave of minions are coming through. And they should be able to get this inhibitor. They do. Season call does finish things up. And now this is the fight. Arta is the first casualty. They are going to slowly see through out. The ocean knocks up Arrow. Wild wow, Charge will clear it up as well. The CC is stacking. The damage is coming. BTR. They want to close this game. And they get AX. They get AX. But the way of the dragon doesn't fight it. Jason Cole. Is he going to go down? Oh. He's trying to outplay it out. Whoa, whoa, auto attack. Into the face. Not enough. But the rest of the team is doing the deeds. They are doing the damages. And BTR are winning this team fight. Although they managed to take both of the members down, they're still AX yes. here. And they're going for it. Now you see it. Now you don't. Who know LY4 was a magician part time because that was the clean sweep. And that is going to be day 2 OBTR.